Crassula are a group of succulent plants. It's a large genus with a lot of variety to offer the collector and gardener alike. Many make great indoor plants and today we visit Succulents Australia to look at just a few of the varieties available. Crassula ovata is by far the best known species. It's commonly known as the jade plant or money plant. Within the genus we have large growing species such as Crassula perfoliata and low growing types such as Crassula namaquensis. Crassula herta is a low growing species also known as Crassula nudicaulis. Long fleshy leaves that are covered by fine white hairs. Crassula muscosa is a small branching succulent sometimes called the watch chain. A popular variety is the cultivar Crassula baby necklace and this is a hybrid between Crassula perforata and Crassula rupestris var marianara and here is Crassula perforata itself. Crassula quadrangularis also known as Crassula pyramidalis is a very slow growing species. Its natural growth habit is to form a square column. Many make great potted specimens and Crassula Morgan's Beauty is no exception. Very compact growing and yes this is the variety with those large red to pink flowers. Again this is a hybrid this time between Crassula falcata and Crassula lesbrianthopus. Crassula socialis is a small growing species. It has small white flowers in spring. Crassula forward is unusual in that its spring flowers are yellow. Crassula perfoliata var minor is sometimes called the aeroplane plant and when you look at the growth habit you can see why. Previously known as Crassula falcata and here we have it in its variegated form. And here it is again in a dwarf or miniature variety. A larger species Crassula rubicolis has great colour at the moment and that's because it has had a bit more sun and has been allowed to dry out a little. Most Crassula will put on more colour in sunny dry conditions. Here we have Crassula barclii and this one is commonly called the rattlesnake plant. It's the end of spring and here we have Crassula cilia. This is a miniature hybrid. Small white flowers appear early in the spring. Crassula Green Pagoda will reach around 20 centimetres or 8 inches in height and is one of a number of stacked Crassula. Ivory Pagoda is another hybrid, slow growing and a Crassula flaccata Crassula perfoliata cross. Crassula decepta is an attractive dwarf species with overlapping foliage. With brilliant patterned foliage, here is Crassula exilus subspecies cooperi. And to us, the most unusual of all is Crassula hemispherica, very rare in cultivation. We hope you've enjoyed our brief look at Crassula here at Succulents Australia. For more information, visit the website and subscribe to the YouTube channel for regular updates on all aspects of gardening.